Hey, everybody. What's up? It's Steve. It's Brent. Sorry we're late. It's my fault. It is always Brent's fault. <laughs> Never. You'll you'll know this over the next few years, brother. It's, they call it blaze time. It's always a few <laughs> minutes time. late. Say hi to Miss Jan Hello. and Miss Julie. This is our studio audience. They will be filming in the man cave tonight. So, hey, Bobby Hotard. Um, Julie's watching. Yeah, she's right there. Okay, good. <laughs> Turn your volume down, by the way, in case. It just It's got to be down. Chris is here. James, let's see. Uh, how you feeling tonight, buddy? I feel good. You just did a jam. I was watching you play some drums with our friend Jack and his wife, right? I did. It, it was a lot of fun. We. Uh... I turned it on, and you guys were playing... Uh, we got the beat by the Go-Go's. That's right. That's one I don't sing. I tell you what, man. <laughs> him playing the Go-Go's metals it out pretty good. He's like... Grr. So it's pretty cool. So, oh, All right, let's see, everybody. Keep piling them in. We have 61 and, and counting. Uh, James, Chris, Bobby, Melissa. Hey, Melissa. Hope you're feeling well. Ginger, what's up? Connie, John, Nelson, my brother, and my brother Joe Anthony, what's up? Day four of Keto. Ah, it's rough. For all you guys out there that are trying to get in shape, it ain't fun. Robin Langdon, what's up? What's up? Marcy, Jeanette, we're up to 77. When we get 100 people, we'll go ahead and get started here. Uh, Bobby, watch your drums. Sam Point event. I know that guy. Hey, Sorry, Sam, Sam, we couldn't have you over here. But uh, oh, uh, you see, what happens is uh, Brent got tested today, so he brought the results over, so we let him in the house. But... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's all right. That's all right. Uh, Chris, Chantel, we're at 87. Keep going. Mark, what's up, Mark? Mark just heard Lillian on 95.7 House of Hair Radio. Cool. What song, Mark? Mike Collins, Terry Crow. Julie, oh, Joey says Julie's going to be the clue champ tonight. He's pulling for me. Oh, you're pulling for her. Okay. Oh, all right, traitor. <laughs> Lonnie, Regina, Jason, what's up? Um, Amanda, hi, Amanda, um, Amy, Al Moran. Where's Al? Al. Man, I miss Al. I, I usually see Al every day. I haven't seen. Him. All right, we're at a hundred people right now. So, yeah. Dwight yeah. Sullivan, I think. I Ken, Mike. All right, guys, we're gonna do. Look, this is. I'm gonna show you what we're doing here. Okay, show him the microphone. Brent's got a mic here. It's a Mister Microphone. It's like you remember the one. Hey, good Top looking. Quality. Be up to pick you up later. So we've got this um, little bitty thing he's singing through, and I've got my trusty. Viper. We're going to do a couple of things. Electric. I've got my silver Guilford out. My acoustic. Uh, we're going to show you Brent's, uh, the stand that he's got his uh, uh, stuff on so he can read from. Uh, you want to show him this is your custom mic stand there, Brent? Where is it? If I can get it in the custom picture. Hold on. I'm going to switch over. Holder. The custom iPad holder. holder. Yes. Right a 12 pack of, of toilet paper. Soft, Soft and, and strong. strong. Great so value. Yeah. yeah. You see? So. Mm -hmm. There's many other things after this is all over and you guys have like 650 rolls of toilet paper in your house. This is what you can do with them. So, <laughs> All right, so I'm going to handle shop vac. You see the shop vac? All right, I'm going to hand this over. Um, Mike Man is 340 in the UK and he's on there. Thank you, man. That's awesome. Wow. All right, we've got 130 people here. Let's get going. All right. Um, turn the phone sideways, right? Yeah, turn it sideways. Sideways. Make sure you can see us. There you go. Is it... Y'all look lovely. Okay, so we kind of, um, we didn't even, he just got here. Yeah. We just kind of figured out what songs you want to do. Uh, I figured we'll start off, we'll do Misery. As you know, it's just me and him, so I'm going to do some ad-libbing, so to speak. Uh, but we're going to do... The song, and after the first song, you guys let us know if you can hear the vocals and the guitar blending okay. So, we'll do Misery. You ready? Ready. Here we go. <laughs>
Now who's the judge? That's my crime. Ain't no sense, but I'm still doing time. Cause misery, misery loves company. Cause misery, misery, misery loves company. Cold and hungry like a dog in the street. We miss you, Sam. Now who's the judge? What is my crime? There ain't no sins, but I'm still doing time. Cause misery, misery loves company. Cause misery, misery, misery loves company. Cause misery, misery, misery loves company. Cause misery, misery, misery loves company. Cause misery. Good. All right. You want to look at some comments? Mm-hmm. Let's pass the phone over real quick. I'll switch it over. All right. And... There you go. All right, guys. Uh, there you go. Let's see. Hey, let's see real quick. Uh, turn. Before you hit live video, turn yeah, turn phone, then hit live. Oh. Okay. Nice looking guitar. Brent will be just fine in this band. <laughs> well, hey, you. Steve. Happy birthday. To your wife, Ethel. Hey, Ethel, how are you? 190 people on right now. Turn the phone, please. Wait, wait. How do they want the phone turned? Well, you got someone at one way and someone at the other. Someone. Which way do you guys want the phone turned? Up and down or sideways? Let me know. Let me know. Upside down. The vocal is a little distorted. All right, there, guys. Right. We're singing through a Mr. Microphone, so we can't really help that much. All right, uh, Richard Kendrick is watching. Hey, Richard, what's up? Uh, thank you, Jason. Appreciate it. All right. Uh, the quarantine clothing. Is that what we're in? You got your socks on. Oh, I got my socks on. Okay, there you go. Um, it, let's see. All right, there we go. Just want to make sure that, uh, okay, there you go. Front row headbanging from his kitchen. All right, here we go, guys. All right. We will go ahead and flip that back. Okay, All just right. do it straight up and down. Okay. All right. Okay. So, I can't uh, fit y'all both at the well. same time. Um, is that doable like this? Want we'll to try that? We can try. It. Sure. All right. We're going to try one that we haven't we've only done a time or two, but we'll do. How about Moonlight in Your Blood? Will that work? Let's try that one. You ready for that? Yep. All right. Here we go. One, two, three. <laughs> i 
Socks are a hit. Let me tell you about these socks. They have brass in them. Dude, yeah, so that's cool. Yes, it's supposed cool. to be good for circulation. So these are special. Very Brett cool. Favre socks. <laughs> no, nice. Know. But they do. They have brass. Brett Favre? Brass in the socks. Brass? I'm sorry. I, I didn't dress for the occasion. I got my Through the Veil shirt on and that's it. Uh, no. Hey, that's my dance song. Huh? 
don't say that I have my shirt on and that's it. You yeah, you do have pants on. He does have pants on. <laughs>
All right. Woo. You're just a beast. Talk. I think we lost power. Did I blow it up? Uh-oh. Uh -oh. oh, wait a minute. There it is. It's coming back on. <laughs> All right. Go ahead now. Hello. Hey, hey there we go. I might have overheated it. Let's see. Is there any kind of... Uh, all right, go ahead. Is it, is it, is it There's not even an EQ. Yeah, you see this? Oh, yeah, okay. Right. Talking it? Yeah, he went, oh, look at there. <laughs> master volume. Let's try that. Okay, go ahead. Yeah, hey, you went too. I might have blew it up. Sorry, man. I, I, owe you, I owe you one. I'm going to have to buy you one for Christmas. <laughs> if you do, get me one that uh, has like a microwave. And a, <laughs> All right, right. Uh, okay. All right, so uh, how many people do we have on there right now? Got 224. 224 people from all over the universe. That's yeah. good. This is fun. We'll probably even play more than we planned on it. Got somebody from Australia. Awesome. Very nice. Very We're cool. all in our quarantine enjoying ourselves. You know what? Steve likes um, koala bears. So anytime y'all want to spend, <laughs> send me a gift from Australia. Can I have a koala bear, honey? A stuffed one. Oh. A stuffed one. Oh. A stuffed. Yeah, there you go. The buns. Oh, right, no, that was good. We'll put them in the nice bunny job. cage. Thank you. Um, let's see. Do you have any requests from anybody on there? Um, Lots of them. You want to look? Yeah, let me look. Let me look. Let me see what everybody's saying. Uh oh. Hey, everybody. What's happening? Hi, hi. What kind of guitar is this? This, my friend, is a Guilford Redeemer. John Guilford. I have I have four of these. It's gorgeous. John and I designed this, and John made it happen. Fantastic guitar builder. I have a, a, eight Guilfords, man. I love them. Uh, nobody knows. We're going to do that one. I promise you we're going to do that. Ken from Pennsylvania. Ryan in downtown Prairieville. Ronnie, what's up? Eric loves the guitar. Thank you, man. I'm going to go back and look at some of these uh, questions here. Letters in the rain. Can we do that? What do you think? Um, I've never done it, but we can do we it. We haven't done that one yet. Um, uh, let's see. Uh, hey, Randy Villafera, my old buddy. What's going on? And Lonnie. Daryl Arnold, hey, what's up, buddy? How you doing, man? Uh, Perry, Dirk, don't fear the Reaper. <laughs> Come on, that's just too brutal right now. In this, <laughs> and it's not a Lillian Axe song. Mona says sounds great, Brent. Oh, yeah, man, Steve, you're good. chopped liver, but Brent, that dude's good, man. <laughs> well, thank you, Mona. Joey from Sheboygan. Steve is a great guitar player. I need a Steve Lay's guitar pick. Well, I. Send me your address. I'll send you one. A Kiss cover tune. You don't need Kiss? Okay, I got one. What? It's not Kiss. Body double. You ready? All right. All right, guys. Body double like this. Never done it. Never done it. Never done it. This will right. be fun. It should be interesting, so just bear with it. It's kind of like Brent and I came to your house, and you just started throwing stuff at us, right? <laughs> yes. And so... Yes. I know he's been drinking all day, so, you know. <laughs> Water? <laughs> Actually, Brett and I are probably about the most boring rock musicians you'll ever meet. Because all we like to do is talk and play video games. And, uh, clue. And clue. Clue. By the way. Did you bring the ring? He forgot it. Yeah, I forgot the you ring. forgot the ring? Because it falls off my finger because it's too Yeah, it falls off because it so was meant it for home. you to have. <laughs> it's, it's in my, my nightstand drawer. It's perfectly right here, though. Mm -hmm. Since... All right, here we so go. Gonna it's have safe. Some, after you lose some of that weight on keto, it's not going to fit you. I know. So I'm going to have to wear it around yeah. my big toe or something. <laughs> All right, we're going to try this. How's it go again? Starts up. Body on top of Right. Boom, boom. Hey, Al. The flame stays the same Live a life of fantasy Lead a life of shame One goes here, one goes there Illusion they create More than a million dollars You can't differentiate They lead you into the fire Which one's the better liar? Body double Just how they try Twice as fun as anyone They're cheap to cheap me I can't get a That's their personality Teach me how you Move the world again Tell me how to make This game of love again Show me differences And only I can tell Two hours at home And one in my life Five 
different with the same identity Back and forth for hours, up and down and in between Something I can deal with doing single-handedly Teach me how you fool the world again Tell me how to make this dream of love again Show me the differences that only I can tell No, he actually does, and I do. Go back and look at the truth. <laughs> All right, sorry about that. We lost you for a second there. We lost everybody. Uh, mm -hmm. Give you time to get back on. Um, must have been the coronavirus in the in the Wi-Fi uh, up in here. The 5G flu. The 5G flu. Come on, everybody's got to wait for 200 something people to get back on mm -hmm. here. This is amazing. In the meantime, let's tell a few jokes. They're coming up. Here we go. And ladies and gentlemen, they're up to seven, up to 13. Let's get it up. Sorry about that, guys. Just come on back on. Uh, it wasn't intermission. They probably thought, God, Steve got mad at Brent and he hung up. <laughs> so, um, all right. In the meantime, while we're waiting for these people to get back up on here, what do you want to do next? Because now I just don't feel like stopping, you know. Show a little love. Okay, we got to vote for that. We can do show a little love, yeah. Um. See you someday, all right? You guys are asking for some trouble. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Uh, Donna wants to know what's on Steve's... What's on my cup? I thought you wanted to know what's in my cup. It's actually like flavored water. Uh, this is Captain America. Captain America cup. Yep, there you go. Mm. All right, we're up to 88. Keep on going, guys. We hit 200, then we'll... Uh, it's the needle in your pain or quarantine. We should have played quarantine. I know, right? Didn't yeah. even think about that. We haven't played quarantine. Blood on the moon. Misery. We played misery. That was the first song. Calm before the storm. All right. You guys also know you can go back and um, and watch all this later on. So appreciate you guys letting us do this. I mean, this is about as raw as you get. This is just us with little lamps that keep blowing. And um, oh, Dory said to thank the wives for being. Up so late. Up so late. It's not, it's only 10 after 10. That's sweet. That's, 
I guess it's kind of... I, that's sweet. Circus that's comes so to sweet. town. All right, we're going to do show a little love in one second. Right, come on, let's get everybody back on here. Uh, yes. yes, we do need a UK tour. Everybody's looking in the back. Who's in the poster in the back there? Okay. That's an Alice Cooper signed poster. Um, Dennis and Angela gave me that. Yeah, Dennis and Angela gave me that poster. That right there, you see the one up at the top? That was back in 92 when Ron and I were doing an acoustic tour of the country and Europe uh, to promote poetic justice. And a lady, she was a grandmother. She was probably in her 70s or so, came to the show. And actually took a snapshot and painted that for me and gave that to me. I thought it was fantastic. There's an old uh, Poetic Justice type picture of one of our fans uh, did that in charcoals for me. That right there, my daughter did when she was younger. All charcoals of me. And uh, I got all kinds of stuff in here. This place is just jam-packed with paraphernalia. All right. Thank you for Body Double. You're very welcome. Bon Jovi. That's <laughs> from Dwight. You want to do Bon Jovi? Go ahead. Just say one word. Just say living on a prayer. Yeah. Just say it. Living on a prayer. There you go. That's about as much Bon Jovi as you're going to get here. Until he takes us on tour. That's all he gets. Uh, my greatest piece of rock and roll memorabilia. What do you think it would be, Jules? Alice Cooper gave me one of his toenails once. Uh, uh, no, I'm just kidding. Um, I don't know. Greatest rock and roll paraphernalia. I don't know. I have a dollar bill signed by all the guys in Poison. <laughs> I don't even know where. Yes, Henry Cecil gave me a flag. The, the, the recently passed great friend of ours, Major Henry Cecil, gave me an American flag and a lot of paraphernalia that was flown in Air Force missions in Afghanistan. Um, that was great. I have a lot of stuff. One day we'll do a whole special on it. Living in the gray. Everybody's going, living in gray, living in gray. You know, living in gray at all? Uh, yeah, I mean, I... I the most difficult guitar solo to master, probably uh, my solo on um, She's My Salvation. The most proud thing I've ever written, the most proud song. Wow, that's a good one, Marlon. Uh, one that means the deepest to me in my heart is probably my apologies off the last album because I wrote it for my son. And if you guys have... The day, uh, Days Before Tomorrow album, if you listen, after track 10, which is my apologies, there's uh, some hidden tracks. There's a song that I sing called You Belong to Me, but there's Jude, and four separate tracks says the words, you, what? What does he say, Julie, again? Going, impossible. The impossible is born. I had a mind freeze. Oh, for a second. The impossible is born. And he was like one and a half years old. He could barely say the oh. words. It's stuck in time forever there, so... Um, yeah, there's a band from South Africa called the Parlotones, and they had a song, and uh, the lyrics were The Impossible Is Born. It's a great band. Y'all should check them out. Favorite place to play has been Japan. Career high in basketball, 51 points, Joe. Uh, the Day I Met You was written not about anybody in particular, but I wrote it when I saw the movie for the boys. I wrote it in about 15 minutes. It was in the middle of the night. I got up. I was inspired because she sang the Beatles song, uh, In My Life, which is a great song, uh, to the troops. Not that I'm a big Bette Midler fan because uh, she's got a great voice, but she has a really bad attitude. But uh, she was in the movie. Um, she sang it to the troops. So I said, you know what? I can do that. I got up and I took the acoustic guitar. And, and on, honestly, in 15 minutes, I wrote the damn at you. Um, so, hey, Rhonda's on there. Hope Malcolm's on too. Mega slow fade. Yeah, right, Randy. <laughs> Andy. Favorite final pop. My favorite vinyl pop, it's a funk, it's not a, it's a pop vinyl, uh, is my one of Jesus that isn't really a, what's my favorite one of those, huh? I can't, I, that's all another story. One day I'll show you all my collection. Can we play the promised land? Uh, I don't know, you don't know the promised land? Not quite on that because it's not in the original, the set for the next show yet. But anyway, let's get back to it. Oh guys, you want to do, uh, what do we say? Um, uh, let's get to another song. Here you go. Yay. Here's Jan. Um, Death Comes Tomorrow? Sure. Yep. Let's try Death Comes Tomorrow. This will be... Yeah. And there's a lot of musical changes yeah. in this song. Clean guitar, piano, and whatnot. So we're going to do our own uh, garage version of Your it. Your youngest right? son is watching the brand. What's that? 
your youngest son is watching. Oh, Aww, Riley. What's up, buddy? Hey, Riley. All right, here we go. Death comes tomorrow. <laughs> Need to get on it so close. Because it, it starts to Let me say something. The power sound like static and then it dies. I got an idea. I think I know what's up. Can you hold that one second? Smoke on the yeah, smoke on the <laughs> How you play it? Watch out, your job's in jeopardy. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, that's embarrassing. I'm not going to play anymore. <laughs> uh, I think I have an idea. Mm. We're going to try. I can tell Riley, hey. Anybody feels like Riley's watching. Clean this mess, they can. Yeah, hey, Riley. Thanks for letting me borrow your. It's dead again. Watch this. I think we got it. There is an hey, actual Riley. AC adapter here. That might be the problem. I don't know. It might be blowing it up. Sure Try now. There we yeah, go. Hey, hey. Hey, hey. One, two, two, two. Aww. Two, one, two, two, two. Yep, yep, yep. Yes, yes, yep, hey, there hey, you go. it's gonna warm up. Now I try. Hey, one, two, one, wow. two, hey, hey, yeah. Yay! Alright, let's get this back to All the right. There we go. Ready? Hit it? Hey, yeah, All one, right. two. It's a little distorted. Alright, we're gonna start off with the verse. Ready? I felt the scorching of the sun. The unforgiving ground beneath me I heard the crackling of the rain The strikes of lightning came to set me free Of my own lips, 
will taste surprisingly decent. Ten thousand miles of stars I bear. Even vultures know the What's going on, everybody? Destroying it. Destroying it. Lots of excitement. Sounds great, Brent Graham. Can't wait to hear you with the full out band. Rock the theme song for the show hard. Sounds great. Hi, Jan from Angela. Jimbo says the most profound thing of the night. Woo, woo, woo. <laughs> Jimbo, I couldn't have said it better, buddy. Could not have woo, said it better. Woo. I know, huh? Um, that's awesome. Okay, we're having fun, guys. It is really fun. Um, yep, Jimbo's digging it. And Jimbo, I trust Jimbo's opinion. He's a, he's top fan, lifer. He's been around a long time. He's, he Jim knows. Jim's a nice fella. Jim reached out to me. Uh, a lot of people reached out to me, but Jim had some really Jim nice things to say. Yeah. Yep, so yep. Thank you, Jim. Thank you, Jimbo. Uh, David says, paranormal is better than normal. Yeah, you're pretty much right on that. You know smoke on the water, dude? I'm serious. I yeah I can, yeah. I can. Find that we can do that because we play it in Sledgehammer. Oh, all right. So I can probably 
not mess it up. Y'all, let's do something different, all right, <laughs> before we do something else. <laughs> Uh, Jennifer says, thanks for playing True Believer for, for me, your sister in South Bend, Indiana, loves you, Julie and Jude. Thank you very much. Appreciate Aww. that. Nice people out there. We really have like the best fans in the whole world. Yeah, Good people. Awesome. Uh, all right. Uh, <laughs> do I love my messed up paranormal crew? Absolutely. I would not risk my soul to anybody else on the planet. Cause you figure out every time we do a ghost hunt, my, um, my uh, spiritual being is in the hands of Dave Young, BJ, and my brother Gary. Oh, God, now that I put it like that, I am screwed. No, I'm kidding. Those guys are the best. That's my Veil team right there. All right? We're, we were just about to start filming the, the pilot, too. And then oh, yeah. the Chinese came and said, We're not like a you paranormal. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I keep thinking I'm on the Love and War show, and I can do that. We know like that, your yeah, like, Through the veil. <laughs> hey, look, you guys came up with the ring, so I don't want to hear anything about it, right? Isn't the ring a Chinese? Oh, it's Japanese. I'm sorry. All right. Within your reach. Oh, that's a great one, too. We, we players see you someday at my pop's... Mo oh, okay. They played. Marlon played see you someday at my pop's memorial. That's awesome. Man, it touches me when people play our stuff. That unfortunately, it's at a lot of memorials and, and funerals and stuff. But you know, it's if it helps to to get people through it, that's great. Yeah. Uh, but the day I met you was like the biggest wedding song of all time. I swear. Um. All right, Malcolm, what's up, buddy? And Wendy's there, and uh, all my friends. All right, uh, we're gonna do this because because we really just feel like it. All right, let's try a little. Um, I don't know how to play this. <laughs> you want me to show you? <laughs> uh, I gotta tell y'all a Josh awesome. LaRose story, okay? Oh, what? A Josh LaRose plays in Sledgehammer and um, Power Shrine, right? So I'm in Sledgehammer with Josh. Josh is the best. He's great. He's a great player, and he's the nicest guy, and he's fun. We have fun all the time cutting on him. So we learn Smoke on the Water for Sledgehammer, right? So we start playing it, right? And, and like, everybody knows... Smoke of the Water is like the first song a guitar player ever learns in his life when you're like five years old. You go, oh no! Wait, wait. So anyway, me or lawyer. Anyway, so um, and the first time we start playing, about and we're getting into the drums, and everything, and Josh comes in all wrong key and everything. So we'll never ever let him down because the easiest song he can play everything else. And then smoke on the water pops up. And let me show you how it's done, Joshua. Ready? Here we go. <laughs> Oh, 
the place But Swiss time was running out It seemed that we would lose the race Smoke on the water Fire in the sky Smoke on the water Cool there, man. My rap career didn't Sin take City. off. Sin City. All right, guys, in a jukebox over here. No, kidding. Uh, can Steve do Sin City? Oh, God. Oh, my shoe's untied. Yes. Brent's too. We both. Uh, we, um, you guys are so freaking awesome. Love your music, Pure Talent. Thank you very much, Amy. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Um, so, all right. Well, I'll tell you what we're going to do now. We, um, we're going to do Show a Little Love. All right. right. Then we're going to do a couple of acoustic songs. And then we're going to go play Clue so I can get my ring back, which he left at home, right? Accidentally. Uh -huh. right. Did you lose it? No, I didn't. Okay. Seriously. Did you pawn it off? No. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> letters in the rain. Did, did, did I pawn Who it wants off? letters in the rain? I, I, just, I know. I was just making a joke. Uh, do we know that? Huh? I, I, yeah, I mean, I would give it a whirl. All right, guys, we're gonna try that. Uh, okay. All right, we'll do "Let Us In Rain," show a little love, and two acoustic songs. How's that? All right, that'll work. There you go. All right, here we go. All right, there you go. All right, let's try it. All right. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Because you're rocking so hard, dude. That's right. Because it's, it's, it's in my soul. <laughs> That's right. So much that I can't stop sweating. Burning lots of carbs. A, a, a nasty, sweaty dude. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Julius, you a I... nasty, sweaty dude. No. Don't answer. Wait. Yeah. Sweaty, but not nasty. There you go. Oh, good answer. Good, nice, good answer. Okay. You can stay here another couple of years. <laughs> Everybody, I profess my undying love for my wife right now. From oh, thank you. I love you, sweetie. All right. Yeah. Love you. Give some to drink. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. All right, let's do it. Uh... <laughs> Upon the weeds of all your broken dreams, 
Someday you've got to give it up In between the lines you'll see I'm giving you a sign Your attitude is just too tough You don't know what I want all night Why don't you make your dreams come true I'll show you how Is what you do Look up to the skies, I see desire in your eyes But you can't keep it in your heart Let's take the night and then we'll sleep by candlelight My flames of love are burning in the dark You tell me you love me, oh You don't know what I want all night I love to make your dreams come true I'll show you how is what you tell All right. Woo -hoo. All right. Woo. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Well, I'll tell you what. This one. <laughs> Let's. Uh, yeah, we'll turn it over to the acoustic guitar for a second here. I appreciate all you guys out there staying on with us this late at night. And LA CDs are hard to find, but I will tell you this. I just talked to Josh the other day, and just like we put out the thumb drive with all the Lillian stuff. We're going to be doing a near-life experience thumb drive. It's going to have like three or four, two studio records, a live double album, maybe a couple of other things too. Uh, we're going to be putting one of those together for you soon as well. NLE was a great band. That was some good stuff there, man, I tell you. Um, <laughs> a lot of great songs. Yep, my boy Joshua LaRose, Dennis Papaleo, my brother Craig, Rob Hovey, Sam Poitavent, Eric Morris. Uh, just who else am I missing? Oki, Bob, I mean, it's just great. Mark wants to know what the amp is. This is a PV Viper, man. This thing has everything on it. It's amazing. I thought I was talking about the Ion Explorer Outback. Oh, yeah, the Ion Explorer. Oh, yeah, oh you're yeah. talking about the vocal mics? That's, that's, that's top a, quality. Yeah, that is. 
That's dude, um, this is old. How old is this? No, it's not that old. It's I got old. that at Sam's, dude. Oh. Sam's, yeah. John Day says, Big Daddy sounds great. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much. 4.45 in Britain. That's the time. 4.45 in Britain. Wow. Dude, thank you for staying up this late. That's awesome, man. Uh, will I hand it to me again, please? Uh, not sure what you mean. Will I hand it to you again, please? But yes, I will, Dirk. Whatever it is. Um, Dory says, thank you, Steve, Brent, Julie, and Jan. Don't stay up this late for just anyone. Thank you very much. Thank you, Dory. I appreciate that. She said it's very healing. That's sweet. Um, yeah, Eric, uh, Richard's saying, I agree. Eric used to have retrieved the body's video. Yep. We did a few videos back then. I can't find them, though, so if anybody's got them. Uh, hold on one second here. NLE was the schniz. I know Renee was, like, the number one near-life fan in the world. And, uh, but it was great. All right. Hey, Malcolm, still got that computer. Which one, dude? You know, I'm old and my brain doesn't work well. You have to remind me about things. Thank you. Danny says, y'all sound great. Blaze and joy very much. All right. Thank you guys. Look, we're going to get back on some acoustic stuff real quick. Um, we're going to do two acoustic songs for you guys. Um, Gorgeous me, um, guitar. I'll tell you what, let me talk to him there. Brent, well, I'll find a good queen tone for this. This tell is him, our. Um, tell them a story about well, tell, three bears. A story. Hmm. Oh, let me tell you a story real quick. This is a great story. I, I was playing in a band uh, when I was a kid, and uh, I don't know if y'all remember a band called Sweet Cheater. I don't know. They were from Alabama, I think. So, but they were playing the hard rock and all. And me and my buddies, we were in a, we were in high school, so we were playing. And we we were writing. Let me give you a little background song. Okay. For music for this. <laughs> and we were writing our own stuff at that time. We were like fourteen and fifteen. And uh, we had a song called We'll Stand Forever. We'll Stand Forever. And so we, the guys in Sweet Cheater asked if we wanted to open up for them. So we said, yeah. So we were playing at a skating rink. Skating rink. <laughs> so I come out, and they got all these hard rockers in the crowd. So I said, we're about to play a song called We'll Stand Forever. And this guy goes, you'll suck forever. <laughs> True story. <laughs> I was I was 14 and I was crushed. I was playing this beautiful background music and I'm waiting for like for me to tell a story. So like sad. Grandmother came in and it was the last dying wish for you to oh, give her a kiss and then she passed away in your arms and now it's like you'll suck forever. You'll suck forever. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah, 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 that's Probably voices in my walls. Oh, yeah. They're all good. BJ, I'll add you as soon as I can. I don't know. I mean, there's a ton of
again. Yeah, it goes we right. never yeah. ever played that yeah. before. That one just winged that. That was good. Very good. Yeah, there you go. That was cool. That's one of my favorites. Never played that acoustically before. How about so pretty. <laughs> <laughs> Where's Al? I know, we need Al to come Al? sing that. All right, um, um, you want to do this? Um, which one? Day I Met You? Sure. Oh. We haven't played this together yet, have we? Let's, let's give it a whirl. All right. What do we have to do to lose but our careers? <laughs> <laughs> That's right. And lots. Well, guys, it's been a lot of fun, okay? So we're going to do one more for you. Ooh, delightful. <laughs> Bill Davis says y'all need a Venmo tip jar. A what? A Venmo tip jar. Venmo oh, tip jar. You can get money. <laughs> I'm in. It's, it's like, like PayPal. PayPal. Would it be cheesy for us to have a, a tip jar? No. I don't think so. No. <laughs> think about it. You know what? I will tell y'all something. I got a contact the other day, an email, and I spoke to a guy from an, a royalty company. They went out, they go out and they find royalties that artists have not received. And he contacted me because he said, you have royalties all over the world that you don't even know about. And Whoa. if you pay us a percentage, we'll go get them for you. And I'm like, sign on the dotted line, go for it, you know? Yeah. Because I have, oh. and it's not a big secret, I have 
been screwed out of hundreds of thousands of dollars of, of royalties over the years. And uh, I do this because I love my band and I love music. And I love the people that we play for. Aww. So. <laughs> Everybody's I'm, saying, I'm like, definitely so, do it. So, we will be looking next week. Okay, we're going to put the tip jar up or the, or the virtual tip jar. These are the only mm -hmm. socks that I own. <laughs> I don't? No, I'm just playing, guys. They All right. Have shoes. Here you go, guys. This is for you. I'm getting serious. <laughs> Awesome. That's awesome. Aww.
Well, very nice, man. Well, I'll tell you what, guys. Uh, it's 11. Uh, yeah, we went a little longer than we anticipated, but lots of nice love. Give us some love out there. Thank you, guys, so, so very much. We really do appreciate that. So I'll read some of these notes. That was awesome, Steve. Thank you. Awesome voice, of course. Dallas, T-O-I. Thank you all very much. There's Nancy. Hey, Nancy. God, we haven't seen Nancy in so long. She's great. Uh, now go get a clue. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, we're going to take all this love into the clue board where it gets yeah, I ugly. Left, I left the ring at home because I knew I'd keep it. Oh! oh. Watch out now. Man, talk, <laughs> talking smack already. That's all right. Uh, thank you so much, guys. Stevie, hands down, best guitars. Oh, that's thank you very much. Can't help think about Journey every time I hear Nobody Knows. It was his song. Yep. Johnny. 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 I, Journey, I'm sorry. Um <laughs> Yes, can yeah, the great late Johnny Vines. Yeah, that was his song. And he sang it with us on the uh One Night in the Temple album live. So yeah. you guys need to get that if you don't have it yet. Got lots of thought, lots of love out there. Man, that means so much to us. It really does. Eric said thanks for lifting his spirits in these dark times. Sounding good. Brent rock those vocals. Awesome. Thank love you. this, love this. Uh great. Um that's awesome, Terry and Gino. Said one of his favorite tunes, man. We got a lot of this stuff. Thank you, Lynn, for the compliments on the guitars there. Thanks. Joey says the song speaks to him on many levels. Uh, <laughs> Astor says, I got a guy for your royalties. All right, that sounds good. Steve, I'm loving this jam live. I'm sitting here with the old soloist jamming with Steve Blaze. All right, very good, man. I forgot about that. I should all the guitar players should tune up and play along with us. That's a great idea. Right, we'll do that yeah. next time. How's that? Yeah. Um, and then you guys can send us pictures of it. Uh, Bill says he'll take 20% of the tip jar since it was his idea. Well, I'm game. You'll have to come down here and, uh, um, and uh, hold it out. Well, you can't hold it out there. No, That's right. No. All right, we'll hook you up. And we will tip you, Angelus. <laughs> That's great. Well, look, guys, we really do appreciate it. On behalf of myself. Yeah, thank you all Mr. very Brent, much. And say goodnight to the ladies, Miss Jan. Good night. Julie. And the stack of toilet paper I have? No, I'm just kidding. I do. It's the same stack that was there two weeks ago. <laughs> I know. Do you know I went to Walmart today? We went to Walmart. I did. And um, walked past the toilet paper rolls, and it was tons of them there, and I didn't even buy one. It's like, that was so March You sure that one 15th. wasn't there last week? No, that one wasn't oh, there. That's, yeah. that's, right. It fell off the top of the... <laughs> She had to give me my holder. But you know what? <laughs> Toilet paper is so like March 15th. I mean, really. Uh, All right, guys. Thank you so much. Look, I appreciate it. And I'll have, I'll have people asking me about the, um, the um, oh, Tina said hi, Julie. Tell her hi. She said hi. And um, just to let you know, listen, um, tomorrow night we're not doing Love and War Show. We're doing it next week. So we'll be on there. Even if it happens to be just me and Todd. And guys, you're home. Go catch up on all 26 episodes of Love and War Show. Subscribe to the YouTube channel. And uh, we are very just, you can't wait for the first Lillian show with Brent. It's going to be great. Say your prayers. Stay clean. Any messages for these guys? Just pray. Uh, I don't know what else we can do right now. Just try to obey the uh, guidelines. Look, I went into Walmart. I had my mask on, okay? I don't, I've, I've got a cool one that Tess made for me. It's got Jack Skellington on it and pumpkins. And it was cool. I had somebody said that, that is a very nice mask. So anyway, Al says we have a curfew. I don't know what curfew we're talking about. Oh, you mean me with Julie? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Who wants one more song? <laughs> Who wants one more song? Do we know one more? Sure, we do. Sure, we can play something. If I get enough thumbs up and, and hearts in the next ten seconds, we'll do another song. All right, anybody? Uh-oh, uh-oh, there they come. Thumbs up, thumbs up, uh, hearts. Come on, I want to see some hearts and thumbs up. And then, uh-oh, uh -oh, there they go. Oh, look at there, look we'll there. do another song it's if like we fireworks. do. Come on, let's see them come. Do somebody do one of the open mouth things that goes, oh, like that. The John Day <laughs> open mouth one. John Day, do an open mouth. <laughs> come on, let me see an open mouth. I mean, that sounds weird. I shouldn't say that. Um... <laughs> All right, there it is. There it is right there. Yeah, yeah. All right, here we go. One more. All right. There you go, Miss Jan. All right, what are we going to do, buddy? Uh, what you, you want to do, man? I don't know, but I'll put the heavy back on. Let's put the heavy you wanna back do, on. You want to do Waters Rising or you want to do...
You want to do Waters Rising? If you want to. Um, what we're gonna do when they come for you? <laughs> Um, we can do either, uh, who wants to win the Steve Blaze guitar pick? <laughs> um, Crucified or Waters Rising, whatever you want to do. I'm going to let you call it. What do they want to hear? Should we poll the audience? Crucified or Waters Rising? The first answer is we'll do it. All crucified right. or Waters Rising? Crucified or Waters Rising? Crucified or Waters Rising? Will this go up on YouTube? Yeah. Yes. Yes. Crucified. Oh, on YouTube. I don't know. Maybe. Probably should put it on YouTube. Crucified or Two Waters crucified. Rising? Okay, Crucified. Ready? Right. One, okay. two. Yeah. Ready, boss? Uh, I'm ready. Um. Come a little closer with your thoughts of an insurrection A little black mark in the book of your life And bring a change of your affection Got a one-track mind, it's a sign of the time Cross the bear when the salt in your lacerations. At least when I die, I can look them in the eyes, get them off to eternal damnation. See the blood stain curtains in the temple of love, where the truth is a state of your mind. Kneel down, kiss the ground, but I'll never make a sound. I'm getting to see when the soul down.
close. I don't even. I never play the chords, man. <laughs> I'm all about the solo, bro. I'm about the solo. <laughs> so anyway, there you go, guys. That was fun. Impromptu <laughs> stuff. <laughs> Jeremy said he does, can't tell us how much he needed this today. Well, I appreciate it, guys. The good thing about it is it is going to be always on my Facebook page. So you can go check it out anytime and uh, just have fun, man. And uh, all the guys in the band, Michael and Rob and Sam and the crew, Jay and Tommy and Big Al, uh, they all miss you guys. And uh, we're ready to get back out there. And so is Sledgehammer, too. So... Thank you for the support. You take care of yourselves. We'll talk to you in the next few. And just stay safe. Say your prayers. We'll be through this thing before you know it, okay? Take care, guys. Say bye, man. Good night, everybody. Thank you all very much. Say bye, ladies. See you. Good night.